and your time is done As we dance our last waltz Darkness will fall I'm so lonely, boy I'm so lonely, boy I nearly didn't. But why this place? Would it have mattered? So that's your answer then? Yes. No chance to reconsider. The past is the past. It's merely a memory for me. And yet for me, it's as though it were still yesterday. My path has been chosen. Not by me, for me. We can forge a new one, together. No. My destiny is one of solitude. Purposeful solitude. My first instinct was to kill you. And yet my anger could not surpass the love I had for you. Your vengeance is justified. Your love gets misguided. I no longer have the capacity to have those feelings anymore. When Maria died, that part of my soul, it, it died as well. I can't believe that. I won't believe it. Whether you choose to believe it or not, what is real is real. Truth is truth. That is not my truth. It has to be. I no longer want to be enemies. I don't have the strength to fight you anymore. You are not my enemy. The battle with the seer provided perspective. How so? On the beast and why I chose not to give in to it. You always were stronger than it. That is why I admired you so. And you are stronger than you think. So I am told, but it will take time for me. How much? More than either of us have. So our only bond now is to make the Templars pay for what they made me do to you and for what they did to me. Agreed, but how? They all wear a mask. But the face behind it remains the same. Majestic. Yes, and the head of that beast. You know who it is? Yes. 
Arrogance always leads to foolishness. And Cornelius has a god share of both. He told you? No. But his lies have led me to the one that does. So what's your plan? We squeeze until they give us what we need. And what if they don't? Oh, they will. Because pain is the great emancipator. And the Templars, they schooled me well in the art of pain. It's time for the student to become the teacher. And after? We pay for our sins, as we all will eventually. Agent Osiris. Who are you? How did you get up here? No, I wouldn't do that. Or else you miss out on what I have to tell you. Besides, I hear you're running on a skeleton crew these days. Didn't that psychotic cohort of yours witness half the staff in the hospital yesterday? Then how would you know that? <laughs> Even good old Chiefy is recovering from an unfortunate accident thanks to that trigger happy telepath. I must say, the cover up is classic. A random gas leak. Is that what they're calling it? Med? Oh, you are good. So you shifted. Not really your style. We are never what we see. So many hide behind the same facade. So long. But that's not why I'm here. Why then? Reminding me we need to update our security system. Hmm. Your sense of humor is improving. Cut the shit, Maddie. What do you want? You know, Osiris, you are one of the few that I can honestly say what you see is exactly what you get. And I've been around for a while. Well, this has been fun. Now how about you tell me the real fucking reason you're here? Well, we are talking about masks. And despite your rudeness, I am willing to tell you who's behind one of them. Let me guess. A certain witch. Maybe a hapless seer. How about a dethroned reaper? Really, Maggie? You're a little late to the game when it comes to unsettling revelations. Hmm. No, Osiris. That would most definitely be you. You don't say. Spoiler alert! It's the alchemist. You mean the god of reality? Oh, color me impressed. Old news. So you know how he intervened? Yeah. I stepped into the whole pile of bullshit. The chief led me right into it. And how he manipulated you? Everyone. No. Just you. Now you're just boring the hell out of me. He is the reason for everything you are, Osiris. Your parents, Riley, Majestic, it was all mapped out for you. And I'm sure you'll tell me the reasons why. Why don't you ask him? See if he'll take off his mask. You need a little more than your ramblings to prompt that kind of conversation. Well, Mommy and Daddy didn't get along, did they? The scene was ugly. Even more so for the child who witnessed the whole thing. Congrats, Maddie. You just affirmed your ability to read. All that shit's in my file. But does that same file contain what he said to you before he pulled the trigger? Careful. 
Or what? <laughs> Don't pull your dick out with me. Get out, Maddie. We're done. In fact, we were done the moment you opened your mouth. Now this is real for you, boy. What the fuck did you say? Isn't that what Daddy said before he pulled the trigger? But seeing as I don't have my heavenly ability to be the past anymore, how would I know that unless he told me? And how the fuck would he know that? Oh, that's right. You never told anyone, not even your beloved wife. So how would he know that? You're asking me? This is your illusion. Because he made it happen, you twit. He was there. Maddie, I swear to God. But I've given you enough information. Now let's see if the hero is brave enough to face the truth. Whatever game you're playing. Oh, oh no. Playtime is over. Shit's about to get downright horrifying. Bye now! <sighs> I hate it when that bitch does that. <sighs> How could she have known? When did this suddenly become my wife? Not in the mood. Nice one. Should have healed by now. It will when we get back to full strength. What do you want? Why did you tell him? That wasn't part of the plan. Because I amended the plan. Not your call. I know a stick. It will always be. as you call it, 
is the biggest part of my plan. Why else would I let that little prick put a bullet in me? <laughs> Darkness will fall